In the last episode of our series, we managed to write a concurrent implementation for the fetching of pages, gave us tremendous performance gains, and that was it, right? Like, that's what we were after. Because we managed to come up with a solution, we might feel satisfied. But that would be a mistake. We want to be able to reuse that code. If you want it to be generic, you have to, to completely separate the TMDB code, which is specific to TMDB API, from the logic that knows how to iterate over the pages and, and retrieve the results. In this last episode, we are going to, to, to look at our code and critique it and refactor it and extract the code to its own library. This is the code we ended up with in the last episode. We have two functions. The first one is called a find which knows how to get a one page, get a result, put it asynchronously on the channel that is being passed as an argument. The second function is called find async. The actual pagination code, the, 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 the function that knows how to go through all the pages and use this a find function to retrieve each page and then collect all the results in channels, then merge those channels and reduce them and then um, read from them. So it, it was working like this. Find async love and then say 30 pages. Okay, so Let's put this in a var. Let's time this just for fun. So that was this very fast uh, execution time. We got 600 results. And I can, I wrote this uh, utility function to, to get the, the poster from the movies. So I can do like